When it comes to speech to text models, then OpenAI's Whisper is sort of a de facto standard now. It's an open source, cloud agnostic and extensible platform or sort of a model for uh, serving state of the art speech to text requirements. It has been developed by OpenAI and it is quite established by now. But in this video, I'm going to share with you a brand new project which is called as Faster Whisper Server. It is an open AI API compatible transcription server that uses Faster Whisper as its backend. It has support for both GPU and CPU. It is quite easily deployable using Docker and we will be deploying it shortly on our local system. It is configurable through environment variables. You can specify your open AI's API key and all that stuff. Also, you can have your audio file transcription via HTTP methods like POST or you could simply do it through Python interpreter and that is what we are going to do. So without wasting any further time, let me take you to my local system and before even I do that, let me share something really cool. So the VM, the virtual machine and the GPU which I am going to use for this video is very generously uh, sponsored by our friends at Mast Compute. If you are looking to rent GPUs at a discounted price, then I will drop the link to their website in video's description. Very, very affordable rates. I will also give you in video's description a discount uh, coupon code. So go to their website, use that code, and you should be able to get 50% discount if you rent out the GPUs, which are already very discounted. So huge shout out to them for being so generous with this VM and this GPU. Now let me take you to my local system where I am running this Ubuntu 22.04 and as I mentioned I have one GPU card of NVIDIA RTX A6000 which has 48 GB of VRAM. Let me clear the screen. Also I will be installing everything in my virtual machine Conda. The version is 24.1.2. If you don't know what Conda is, please search the channel. You should be able to find it on the um, channel in any video as how to install. Very straightforward. Let's clear the screen. And now let me create a virtual environment with Conda. And I'm just going to call it Faster Whisper. Should be done any second. And now just press Y here. It is going to install everything for you. That is done. Let's activate this and step into this faster whisper. And you will see that it is now in parentheses on the left hand side. Let's clear the screen. And now let's git clone the repo of this faster whisper server. And I will also drop the link to it in video description. So don't worry about it. Should be quite quick. That's already done. Let's cd into it. Let's clear the screen and then do ls-ltr you will see that we have some sample audio wave file which we will be using for our demo and there is a docker compose file and also a docker file here one is for cuda for gpu if you are using cpu then replace uh, cuda with cpu so as i have gpu so i am going to use this one let's clear the screen and now in order to run it all you need to do is to run this command which i am going to paste now this so what this does is it just offloads everything to gpu it uses local port 8000 and it cre creates a local docker volume maps it here and then run it with our CUDA so let me run it you see it was unable to find the image locally so it is downloading all the images so this makes it quite easy that everything remains in one place in these layered containers so let's wait for it to finish quite big as you can see the especially this i guess this is a model which is downloading at the moment so let's wait for it to finish downloading everything and then we will proceed further it has pulled all the layers extracted them and now it is waiting for application to start and the application is started at this port 8000 on our local system so I'm going to let it run and then we will open another terminal window and try to access it from there. So while this one is running here, I'm just going to go into my another terminal window of the same server and then we would need to set to environment variable first. 
first you need to set this open ai's api key for that you would need to go to platform.openai.com and unfortunately it's a paid option so you would have to uh, put in like ten dollars in order to get started and then you will get an api key which you need to export here plus uh, another variable you would need to put in is the base url we will set it to localhost at port 8000 where our server is running so let me set both of these environment variables and then i will clear the screen and then we will proceed further so i have set the environment variables next let's install our openai so i'm just going to say pip install openai dash dash upgrade if it is not already installed that is done let's clear the screen and now let's fire up our python interpreter that is done and now let's first import our open ai so i'm just going to go with this that is done and now let's initialize um so here you can either pass on your open ai's api key and environment variables again or you could just get it from there so for the sake of simplicity i'm just going to put my open ai's api key here and base your uh, url here and then i will clear the screen i have cleared the screen after setting that environment and now let's grab our audio file so if you remember i showed you that in the same um, folder we had this audio.wav file so let me open it and save it in this variable audio file that is also done and now with the help of this client.audio.transcription we'll be creating the transcript for the, from that audio file by using this distill large version 3 model from openai by using our own locally running faster whisper server that was done it was fairly quick and now let's print out the transcript.text and since uh, when i printed the transcript.text it has given me this text which says that when you call someone who is thousands of miles away you are using a satellite let me also show you uh, the audio so this is audio let me play it when you call someone who is thousands of miles away you are using a satellite so you see the voice quality is not that good in that that audio but still the model was able to do it which is quite good so if i show you the terminal log you see that it has also shown that it has it has the faster whisper server has done the transcription and it just took under seven seconds or maybe 5.7 seconds of audio in this 0.83 second how good is that and then if i go here this is what it did amazing stuff so quite fast i must say i mean i have done the transcription with the open direct one this one is quite fast so really good stuff let me know what do you think about this i will drop the link to its github repo in video description if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel and if you're already subscribed then please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching